Hello, this is a quick how to use the computer log sheets video for CFRU 93.3 FM. When you come in to do your show uh, in the on-air studio on computer B on the screen here, you'll see it marked computer B at the bottom there, uh, there is an icon on the screen that says log sheet. Uh, it's a FileMaker Pro program. So you can open the program there by double clicking on that or usually the program is already open from the programmer before you uh, and there's a little tab at the bottom of the screen that says FileMaker Pro Advanced. So if you click on that, the log sheet program will open for you. Um, so you, uh, if you look up at the top here, if your show is on the air regularly, if you've been approved for a regular time slot, uh, you can click on this uh, little drop down menu that says click here to select your show and you can find your show from the menu here just scroll down and it'll fill in some of the details there your name uh, your email address the show description the catalog number which sort of best describes the type of show in CRTC numbers and uh, the day of the show the one thing in particular that you'll have to fill in each week is the show start and end time so uh, that just indicates if you're starting a few minutes early or a few minutes late to, to uh, cover someone else's programming. Uh, you can indicate it there. And the show end time, same deal. So once that's filled in, uh, if you have any guests in the studio, you can fill in their name here. Use their real name, please, uh, and not like a DJ alias or anything like that, just so we know who's around the station. Um, and then uh, you can just start adding content. So with the log sheet you need to add content in chronological order as you put it to air each week. So uh, with this little orange button here you can add rows for content as you need them. So if you click that you'll see it adds some rows. Uh, with the log number here that's uh, basically it's a CRTC coding system for types of content. Uh, if you look down at the bottom of the page here, you'll see this log number key, which will indicate any of the, the numbers you'll need. Um, generally, for open format music, you're going to be using the number 21. Um, that includes you know, hip-hop, punk rock, folk music, soul music, uh, all sorts of stuff like that. Um, you can also, uh, you know, if you had a jazz program, you'd be using 34 uh, for most of the music content. Uh, and then for spoken content, most of what you'll be using is number 12. Uh, spoken word, all other talking, including when you're playing PSAs, public service announcements, um, any kind of station IDs or promos, anything like that, will fall under 12. Um, and there's other content here. If you had a theme song, number 41, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, and you can refer to that as you need it. So if we started with the theme song up here, we would write 41 and then uh, with with any music content you don't have to indicate the times. Um, so we just skip these sections here but under artist uh, you'd write the name of the artist there. Uh, so we'll say our theme song is uh, Royal Trucks. from the album Accelerator and the song title Juicy Juicy Juice. Uh, now if that song is Canadian you'd put a check mark here in the box. Uh, if it's new, if it was released in the last four or five months, you put a check there. If it's a hit song, which we generally don't play on CFRU, you would make a mark there. Uh, and if it's an entirely instrumental song, you would put a check mark there. Uh, this song that I've picked is none of the above, so I'll remove those checks. Um, you can, with CFRU, you can also, uh, with this log sheet system, uh, on the far side of the screen here, the far right side, there's a column for spine numbers, uh, which is anything that's in the, CR, the CFRU library will have a spine number on the side of the CD. Um, so you can type in the name there. I'm just going to randomly type in some numbers here and see what pops up. Um, and then when you click anywhere else on the uh, screen, it'll fill in some of the details there. So you've got 
the band 123, the album New Heaven. Uh, it'll give you the label as well there, and you can write in the song, you know, depending on which song from the album you pick. Um, so, uh, scrolling back over here, that's how you enter in some music content, especially for a theme song, uh, and then uh, as you go through, you'll be entering in, you know, 21 for, as I said, more popular forms of music, um, like pop song structure stuff like folk and uh, indie rock and heavy metal and hip hop and, and dance music of all subgenres. Uh, when you get to a section where you've spoken on the air, um, to document that, you'll type 12 for all most spoken content will go under 12 and then you want to keep track of the times so we'll say from 4.05 to 4.10 we were speaking on the air and you can just write talk uh, and that's enough for that uh, information there. If it was a PSA you were playing, you just write PSA, uh, promo, ID, etc. Um, usually that stuff goes at the end of your log sheet because it's at the end of your show. Um, so that's most of your log sheet. You just enter content throughout. Make sure you're keeping track of times for any spoken content at all, interviews, um, you know, anything that you're using, external sources that you're using that feature talk. Um, just make sure that you're documenting um, everything properly there uh, throughout your show and then when you're finished um, if you've completed the log sheet during your show you just hit this green button and it'll send it off to your music coordinator for review uh, if you need a little more time um, and the new show the next show is coming in you can hear, hit this uh, yellow button click to save an incomplete log sheet and go into the, uh, the vinyl library room computer and finish filling out your log sheet there and then send it off to, uh, to uh, your music coordinator. So again, uh, once you're finished, you just hit submit log sheet. And it may take a moment, but it'll send it off. And that's your digital log sheet at CFRU. If you have any questions about this at any time, please let your programming coordinator know. Thanks for listening.